In this video, we'll look at the type of reaction for NH3 plus O2. This is ammonia and this is oxygen. And when you first look at it, it kind of looks like it might be a single displacement reaction. You have this oxygen here all by itself that could come in and maybe do some type of displacement. But on closer inspection, it really doesn't work that way. The oxygen does go with the nitrogen, but it also goes with the hydrogen. So it's not a single displacement reaction. Because oxygen here is a single element, it's just the oxygen, I don't think we would consider this a double displacement reaction either. We could say that this is a combustion reaction. That's because the oxygen here is combining O2, is combining with the compound here, and we have water on this side. So I think you could get away saying this is a combustion reaction. There's another type of reaction that we could call this, and that's a redox reaction. In a reduction oxidation reaction, we have electrons exchanged between atoms. So the hydrogen is always plus one. We have three of them, so this has to be minus three for the nitrogen. Oxygen, when it's bonded to something, is almost always minus two. So here, nitrogen has a plus two oxidation number. So it went from minus three to plus two. By itself, when we have O2, the oxidation state is zero. Here, the oxidation state is minus two minus two here as well, and this is plus one. So you could also call this a redox reaction. So combustion reaction and redox would be the types of reaction for NH3 plus O2 yields NO plus H2O. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.